It's been two weeks. I've been locked up in, in my apartment. I, I feel like I'm on house arrest. I haven't done anything wrong. Do you, do you know what's going out? Do you know what's going on out there right now? Like, I can't even talk. It's, it's frustrating. I'm running out of food. I'm running out of water. People are eating each other's faces. People are running around saying it's a zombie apocalypse. Save me. Please save me. No, don't step on that. That's my baby. I don't know what they're talking about. I, I just got married last month. Almost, almost two months now. I got married. I haven't seen my wife. For all I know, somebody's chomping on her brains right now. Sean Fury? I haven't seen Sean... What up, bro? Oh. I just got here. Your door was unlocked. I figured I just let myself in. Oh, oh sweet, film. Huh? Yeah. All right, cool. Kind of messing with our viewers again. Oh, uh, yeah, what up? This time Irene didn't take it. Ah, the zombie ah! apocalypse! That's what we got to talk about today. The big zombie apocalypse. It seems that everything I've worked so hard for on my YouTube channel is finally coming to life. Yeah. Well, we can only hope that they watched and they uh, train. Uh, you know, my all his uh, fault. We have to say something. We are not dead. Anyway, we're here to review three major things. My placement's off. Leave me alone. I haven't done this in like six months. Right? I know we're a little. Uh... So we're here to review three things. One of which is the zombie apocalypse. Two, we wanted to review uh, Comic Con in Philadelphia, which I didn't go to. But, you know, I was there. Maybe our, you saw me? Our, our Jedi friend over here did. The third one is, how can we ignore it? We are hero, the Avengers. Um, so, first off, let's uh, let, let's talk about the Avengers first, because that'll probably be the quickest one. Good guys assemble. Good guys break up. Bad guys just about to win, and then... Good guys. Oh! We'll do a, your biggest pro and your biggest con with the movie. We'll do my biggest pro, my biggest con, and then the viewers can comment below. What? Right down there. Right down there, and you can tell us your biggest pro and your biggest con with movies. Go ahead. All right, so my biggest pro with the movie was um, the whole movie was a giant pro. I'm not going to lie. Everything put together was so nice, awesome. My biggest con is the Hulk. <laughs> Why would you have Bruce Banner have gray hair? When did he become, you know, a, a different color? What? what? Yeah, and not only that, like, oh, I'm so uncontrollable in the spaceship, and then, you know, oh, the world's in the air. Oh, now I can control it. Yeah, I'm cool. And now I can talk, puny humans, you know, puny god, whatever he said. It it was earth-shattering to me how, how far they missed the mark with that. But the CGI Hulk was awesome. But I feel like the entire, they could have called it the Incredible Hulk, too, because the whole movie was based around him. Besides the aspect of, you know, the team... It was, you know, oh, Loki wants to unleash the Hulk. Oh, well, now the Hulk comes and saves the day. Look, I take out big shit. Even though five minutes later in the movie, Iron Man has no freaking problem. Why'd you need the Hulk? All right, my biggest pro... I think my biggest pro... My favorite the aspect of the entire movie was all the way at the end, right as the main battle is commencing, at the very, very end, when uh, uh, the one Chitara screams... Mm -hmm. And the Hulk screams back at it, and that leads to the uh, panoramic uh, circling of the camera when you see every All single of one of them coming an Iron Man. When movie. they assemble. assemble! My biggest con is probably, I'm going to go ahead and say my biggest con was the fact that Captain America did not once say Avengers Assemble. Or Nick Fury didn't say it. Now it's their turn. Biggest pro, biggest con. Comment. All right, so that was the Avengers. What's next? What's next? Come on, we're gonna next. Begin. I think we have to uh, talk about Comic Con. I personally it. missed it. Um, our friend here, Sean Fury, um, got to meet a lot of cool people. I met uh, Diamond Dallas Page, Lita, uh, Paul Bearer was there, and to top it off, oh no, I'm lying to you, not to top it off. Uh, Gail Kim was there, and uh, Matt the South, Jimmy Hart was there. To top it off, even though I didn't get his autograph because yeah. I spent the money on DDP's autograph, probably the coolest guy there. Ted DiBiase Sr. He was the man. No line. Did no. you hear Did you hear him do the laugh? No. Uh, but I, I swear to God, legit walk, just walked right up to the table, shook his hand. We talked for literally 15 minutes. He's a really, really nice guy. Cool. Yeah, cool. so that was probably the... That was the, that was the pop of the night. So I want to get into this uh, zombie apocalypse thing. Let's hit it, baby. This shit's my so, fucking... All right. So... Creme de la creme. As, although it, it's exciting to think about zombies and to play zombies on YouTube, um, I have some bad news for you guys. Uh, 
Zombies don't exist. I need to I need to set the record straight that I am so skeptical of this zombie apocalypse because not only has everything been proven that this zombie apocalypse isn't right. See, I've seen your film, but your film came from the future. But um So you you don't believe the whole you don't believe the hype. It's like Goldberg when he came back in 03. You don't believe the hype? Didn't Come believe on. that. Triple I won't believe this. All right. See, the thing is, this is what I don't get about zombies, right? Zombies are my basically mindless creatures. That, Which is funny because all they eat are brains. So that's my thinking? problem. Oh, okay. that's my problem. Is okay, I'm gonna go ahead and say it's not people being reanimated from the dead, according to a not so credible source. Um, apparently down in Florida, some very severe uh, hazmat spills, uh, the hazardous materials. Yeah. And apparently, you know, within the week following the hazardous materials spills, um. That's when people started, like, biting noses off of other people, and uh, that guy growled at the cops. But go ahead, continue on. But, that, but that's the thing. Even if it's a nuclear spill, all right? I've seen Citizen Toxie a million times, all right? what? Citizen Toxie. The Toxic Avenger. Oh, my God! Yeah, okay. Yeah. Lemmy was in it. Yeah. He hasn't seen that movie. But anyway, I've seen that. I understand that nuclear can mess with your body. But it ain't going to turn you into Spider-Man. Exactly. Listen, I'm going to be honest with you. All right. Go ahead. I don't think that this is the zombie apocalypse. At the same time, that person in Florida... He ate a person's face. He ate a person's All face. All those women on the beach, and he ate a person's face. Because, because he ingested bath salts. Let's sum up this entire thing. Comic-Con was awesome. The Avengers are coming to eat your face. And zombies save the world. All Hallelujah. Right. So we're going to end on a bracket.